How's it going, guys? It's uh, that Skywalker guy with another review. Today, I am reviewing Viking Cycles' brand new backpack. This is the first backpack. Pretty cool. It's supposed to be a motorcycle specific bag, but I'm a backpack guy. I, uh, I am the backpack guy in the groups. I've always had a backpack. I have like six or seven at home, like, no lie. I have one that looks like almost identical to this backpack and on Amazon when I bought that about three years ago it was labeled a tactical assault bag and I feel like that's exactly what this is um, they are advertising it for motorcyclists um, and while I would say it's not a motorcycle specific bag it is a perfect bag for any kind of motorcyclist as you can see it's pretty big uh, this is what it looks like when it's full if you're going on a long ride if you're out on a track day like we are here, we are at Thunder Hill. Check this out. Our buddy's out here uh, riding track days. You need a lot of uh, gear to bring with you. This is perfect. This is my camera bag for the day slash snacks slash anything really. I got clothes in here too. It does have these patches on here which are kind of cool. And it says Viking Cycle and it says VC right here. It doesn't say Viking Bags, which there are two separate companies and you would think that uh, Viking bags would have been doing this, but it is Viking Cycle. These are non-removable, they are stitched in, but they did give me an American flag, which does remove. And this is Velcro up here, so you could put your own uh, patches if you like. Uh, if you make custom Velcro patches, they'll fit right there. It is Molly compatible on the outside, on the front. They got Molly on the sides. Um, it looks like on the straps as well, so you could, essentially strap a um, first aid kit bag on here as well you could uh, attach water bottles on here you could this is a fully customizable backpack um, it, these things are great these things are great it has multiple straps anything you see on an assault bag it has I really don't know what this strap is for I feel like you could put a um, sleeping bag or something in there pack roll but uh, let's get into kind of the sizes of uh, these uh, pockets here so this is your admin pouch this is your front small pouch and right now I have just a piece from one of my GoPros in there but usually I'll put pens, papers, pads, anything you need in there. It has a um, smaller pouch, kind of another um, admin pouch, I don't know what you would call this but this definitely has, you know, it's got spots for um, pencils and pens, notepad, this is really where you would put that in. I do have a multi-tool in here, a couple little things hidden under here, I got a pocket knife. I just put a couple little extra things in here today just to be prepared. This is kind of cool though, how much you can fit in the, uh, the big compartments. I have three Gatorades in here and I had my tripod in here as well. It fit no problem. And um, I still had room for, some of the stuff's taken out. But I bought some clothes while I was out. I got a first aid kit. I got sandals. Yeah, because my feet like to be comfortable. But um, one of the coolest things about these bags is if you pull these clips off here on the side, I gotta pull these off here on the side as well, which um, are great actually. You can cinch it down, keep everything nice and tight in the bag. But this is something your school bag won't do. You're gonna say, oh, I'm just gonna take my school bag I, I, used for, I used to have from high school. I'm gonna take that out on the trip. Well, school bags only zip down about halfway. These um, assault packs, you can open them up all the way and um, really pack it real tight um, you know flip this up on top um, I used to take my motorcycle to uh, martial arts I used to do uh, judo and I used to put the entire gi those big uh, heavy cotton clothes that they wear I put the entire thing I fold it up nicely and it would and it's thick if you don't know what they are if you do know what they are you know they're really thick it fit in here perfectly and it would have been a nightmare to fit that in a regular bag you just take this flap, snap it over on top, zip it up, and you're good to go. I've, I've ridden with this for a couple months now, before I did this review, so I can really get in depth on it. And when you're riding it, it stays nice and secured on your back if you use the straps to secure it. Um, it doesn't feel like it's going anywhere. I've weighed this thing down with a lot of gear, took it on some trips, and uh, it was no problem. Also has a couple straps here. Let's see. Um, if you know about assault packs, if you know about hiking, you'll know more about the names of these straps. But it's got a front strap here. 
It's a nice heavy duty strap. Nice to heavy duty buckle there. Check that thing out. That's actually really nice. It's not your flimsy um, school bag. Even has straps on the bottom. So you could put a pack here and strap that in. And uh, overall, like I said, um, I am a backpack person. I like using backpacks on rides. I only have one motorcycle specific backpack. Um, and I don't think that's exactly what this is, but this is a perfect bag for a motorcycle rider. This is perfect for hiking, this is perfect for anything, anytime. So I'd highly recommend it. The other thing is, is the stitching and construction of this one is very good. Sometimes you buy these assault packs online, you don't really know what you're getting, the stitching comes undone, it's, you know, poor build quality. Not this one, Viking Cycle did not skimp on the build quality. Um, yeah, so that's basically my review of it. That's what I think of it. It's a good backpack. Um, if you're a backpack rider, if you like riding with, you know, gear, you like being prepared, this is the bag to get. So, thanks Viking Cycle for sending this to me. And, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want to pick this up, there will be a link in the description. I think F-Bomb has a percentage off. Don't you? What's the percentage off? What's the... 12%. 12% off. Do you remember what your code is? No, but I can put the link in the description, so all they have to do is click the link. Hey, all right, so we're gonna have a link in the description for F-Bomb's special link. If you click that link, you can get 12% off on your purchase from Viking Cycle. So you can save a little bit of money, pick up this backpack, it's pretty awesome. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you liked the video. If you liked it, hit the like button, subscribe, comment down below. If you have any questions about the backpack, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. And um, yeah, I will catch you guys in the next one.